watches a hurricane named Dorian, residents have a different perspective here. With less than a year behind us following Hurricane Michael, the anxiety is still real. News 13's Madeline Bierster is live now from First Presbyterian Church in downtown Panama City to tell us how the community is reacting. Yes, Amy, I'm live here at First Presbyterian Church here in downtown Panama City, where as you can see behind me, they're still struggling to fully recover from Hurricane Michael less than a year ago. Now, although Dorian won't hit us, Bay County residents are still very concerned. Hurricane Dorian images and graphics can make many feel as though they are reliving the storm all over again. With Hurricane Dorian shifting constantly, it's hard to find a sense of reassurance that another storm won't happen again to the residents here in Bay County. PTSD and anxiety are affecting locals who are watching the news about another big storm. We spoke to viewers about how these images make them feel. I think you're just like me, just waiting to see what's going to happen. But uh, I think we're definitely not the only ones. There's a lot of people here who definitely have some kind of PTSD after all that. It's a lot of anxiety I feel mixed up in the air and everything. And while Hurricane Dorian isn't coming here, it still conjures up images of Michael less than a year ago. Even though the people tell them that, that we're going to be missed, they're still buying up everything. They're still getting gassed. And we've been traumatized. We even get shook up when we have a big storm, thunderstorm. You can see the panic and they were thinking about boarding up a week ago. Dorian's coming along now. Everybody's just got this big knot in their stomach. We spoke to News 13's chief meteorologist Ross Whitley to get his take on why the storm can trigger many bad memories. Uh, those impacted last year can relate to what's going on with Dorian, especially over the Bahamas, and, and that doesn't bring up good emotions for just about everyone. So people are uh, feeling strongly and remembering about Hurricane Michael last year. While we continue to rebuild and recover here and be Panhandle strong, the Panhandle residents will continue to pray for the victims of Dorian. Live in Panama City, this is Madeline Bierster, News 13, Panhandle Strong.